okay so this is how my body is looking right now um, I am I've been carb eating too many carbs I call it carb loading but really for me it wasn't something that it was just something I was doing out of loving carbs so I did get a little expanded um, so this is August the 14th 2013 and I just reduced my carbs today so we're going to see how that works out within the next uh, week or couple of days but I'm on my way to the gym right now to work out and right now I weigh about 132 pounds my goal weight is 125 pounds um, I don't feel fat and I know I'm not fat so I'm not doing it to because I'm fat or I feel fat I I just feel like I would feel lighter and for my height I'm 5'5 five, five, 125 to me um, I'll just say 125 because I'm thinking of the seven pound difference in my mind how I want to look um, plus one day in the in the future next year I do want to compete in a competition um, either figure or bikini I know I have to that's a long way to go for that transformation but I do want to one day get on the stage and just do it for the fun of it if I win that would be awesome but I do want the experience also of just being um, up on the stage and doing uh, participating in something that show forth the hard work that I do every day in this lifestyle so just an update um, well not an update actually just an intro of where I'm starting from well not where I'm starting from because that's a different video I actually used to be 270 pounds and then I joined the gym um, uh, this was back in uh, 1998 I was 270 pounds and um, um, obviously I lost like 240, 237, I mean 137 and um, yeah 130, 138 and so I did it proper nutrition, exercise. I was a little embarrassed about going to the gym at first you know people laughed at me when I was doing aerobics classes when I was 270 but I stuck with it. Um, I just did a lot of research on diet and um, proper nutrition and of course when you first start to learn it's you learn the, it, the, the, the magnified versions of things of course you know eating an apple is different from drinking apple juice and eating an apple pie of course you know eating a salad with light dressing is better than eating a salad with bacon and ranch and high fat cheese so really it's sticking close to nature those are the things that I already knew even at at, at when I was big I already knew that so I kinda just went towards the basic logical way and of course I did a lot of substitutions like fat free cheese um, instead of high fat went to 2% first and then fat free then I went from whole milk to 2% to skim and now I don't even use milk dairy I use almond milk and some coconut milk I haven't tried rice milk yet but I do use almond milk and coconut milk um, I, so you know each year it gets more defined of the information that you that's put out there is so much information that's good and some over the top some not so good but if you do research your knowledge of exercise your knowledge of proper nutrition will enhance and you become your own doctor not that you would diagnose yourself with anything but you will become your own nutrition it's your own personal trainer so you don't have to be codependent on anyone if you fall off you have so much knowledge and information that you can always go back to it knowledge is power power is transformation so don't choose to be a cripple where you want someone to do everything for you choose to be empowered um, if you're learning from someone we all learn from someone that's still you being empowered so you take take the information don't expect someone to always do everything for you because then you're gonna have to always go back to them because we all slip we all fall off the wagon from time to time whether we're going on vacation whether we're emotional eating 
whether we're on a menstrual and we're just whatever you know it's no excuse to do it but we all have setbacks and when you have a setback it's good to know that you have the information to get yourself back on track and you don't have to say hey how much you charge i need to come back or i need to do this or i need to join weight watchers i need and weight watchers is perfectly awesome i did weight watchers before perfectly fine but i'm, I'm saying you have the tools in yourself when you learn so that's just the intro to where I started. On my next video, I'm going to show pictures, before and after pictures. Well, this is so far the after, but before pictures when I um, was big. Um, and so we'll see that then. But I'm on my way to the gym. Um, and you guys have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.